Two years ago, I reviewed the Clips 5 powered bookshelf speakers. To date, they have been the best powered monitors that I've reviewed here on this channel. Now today, I am super pumped because Clips has sent me their brand new Clips 5 McLaren Edition. In this video, I'll provide an unboxing and overview as well as several audio demos at the end of the video, so make sure you stay tuned all the way to the end. Now, if you're interested in either the original Clips 5s or the McLaren Edition, I'll have links to both of them down in the description below. All right, let's go ahead and get to unboxing. I am super stoked about this. When I saw the first video of the McLaren Edition a few months ago, they look incredible. Now, I've always been um, not really a car aficionado, um, especially in the, um, the Formula One racing, but I love fast cars, and this just exudes speed and elegance in these, so I'm excited to check these out firsthand. So opening up the box at the very top, it does talk about the Clips Connect app, and I'm really excited to check that out. Now the Clips 5s has the ability to make some tweaks to the sound via the app, so we'll definitely be checking that out in just a bit. Here we have the remote control as well as batteries with the McLaren and Clips logo. We've got the owner's manual, a really cool color brochure that talks about all of the features of the 5s. They also included this really cool aluminum plate. Now there's no stand on it, so I guess you could put it up in your room or on a desk, something like that. We got another box here with accessories. So one thing they've done that I really like, this is really cool, not only in design, but it's just a nice braided umbilical cord. This is going to attach from the passive speaker to the active speaker. And then we also have our power cord here and then a USB cable as well. But now for the good stuff, let's go ahead and take off the lid. Removing the speakers from the box, we've got this cover as well as our magnetic grills. Check this out, guys. I am loving this grill. It's a lot more durable than the previous grill on the original fives. If you remember back in my video, there was some kind of ruffling of the edges here. This is a lot nicer finish because it's a totally different material. And then of course, you've got the McLaren logo down at the bottom. And now let's remove the cloth and take a look. Wow, guys, I am absolutely loving this matte black finish. Let's go ahead and take a look at the specs. Up top, we've got a one inch titanium LTS tweeter surrounded by a 90 degree by 90 degree Tractrix horn. Below that is a 4.5 inch carbon fiber woofer. Looking at the primary speaker on the right, we can see the amp plate on the back. Starting at the top, we have an HDMI input with ARC, now this will allow you to connect the fives to a TV and get sound from your TV directly into the fives. To the right of that is a USB service port, a toggle switch to determine whether or not your left speaker or right speaker is your primary speaker, and a button for pairing the unit. If you've got a turntable, we've got inputs for phono on the left. In the middle, we've got an input for a turntable, a toggle switch for line or phono depending on how you're using it, a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary input, as well as a subwoofer out. We've also got digital connections for an optical input, as well as a USB input. If you're using a turntable, we've got a connection for the ground. Then at the bottom, we have our speaker cable connection, which is a bi-amp speaker connection. And then over the far right, we have our AC power connection. And then at the top, we have our large Tractrix port. Then at the top, we have a copper wheel that allows us to select between TV, Bluetooth, optical, USB, auxiliary, as well as phono. And then down at the bottom, we have our master volume knob. Now on the bottom of the original fives, we had a cork base, but check this out guys. On the fives McLaren edition, in true McLaren style, we've got a tire tread. Now, not only is this design wise really cool, but it also is very functional as it keeps the speakers from sliding around while playing. Attach the two speaker cables, tighten them down, and secure the power cable right here. The Clips Connect app provides a three band EQ, the ability to save custom settings, subwoofer volume control, and the ability to update the firmware directly through the app. 
Once you download the app, you'll also want to download the Clips 5's updater. Once both are installed, open the Connect app and it'll walk you through connecting to Bluetooth and pairing the device. You'll want to make sure that you grant Bluetooth and network access. To add a device, simply click the drop down menu at the top and then the plus icon down at the bottom right to add the Fives McLaren to the app. If you have both the original Fives and the McLaren edition, you can simply rename the speakers so that you can easily tell which speakers you're controlling via the app. Once you're set up, you can manually adjust EQ settings to your liking, choose from various presets, or you can even create your own custom preset. You have easy access to enable or disable dynamic bass, night mode, select an input, as well as adjust the master volume. In the settings, there's an auto power option that puts the unit in standby mode after 15 minutes of no signal or inactivity. Klipsch also has a speaker placement section that will utilize DSP depending on where you have them set up in your room. Choosing wall will provide a negative 3 dB reduction in bass. Choosing corner will provide a negative 6 dB reduction in bass or other if your speakers are not placed next to a wall or a corner. Life goes up and it goes down. I know my mom taught me that. I figured why we fool around so little and we keep track of time. Being so serious, idiots. Thinking it will matter, keep me company downtown. Before the clock runs out. Sun is shining, but the rain is welcome too. Friends are nearby, don't need another view. Time is not on my mind, but then it's here. Oh, All things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not ready, let me have another day Don't wake up, wake up Keep it steady cause I'm happy I'm not gonna wake up